Miss Molly, I'm going to do a Thanksgiving cook. You want some food? You love daddy's cooking. Yeah, you love daddy's cooking. <laughs> you want a turkey meal? Yeah, you love my cooking. <laughs> you love daddy's cooking. All right, guys, I'm going to prep a Thanksgiving meal here. I kind of go over what I plan on doing this year. I usually do a double turkey, you like 13 pound turkeys or so, and I could put them back to back. And I got some extra legs and a couple thighs. So I'll put them in there and maybe drop a couple of them. I got some, um, what I'm going to probably do is, this year on the stuffing, what I'm going to do is, I got this cornbread mix on the stuffing. I think I got a couple of containers here for the stuffing. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to make like a meat stuffing, meat cornbread stuffing. And I got hamburg, I'm going to render down, I got some charisse, and I got some Italian sausage. That's all going to get rendered down, then I'm going to render down, I got some of these cranberries, dried cranberries, I'm going to throw them in the stuffing. Green pepper, onion, mushroom, and celery. I'm going to kind of prep all that, cook all that in a pan, pre-cook all that stuff with the meat. And that's all going to go in with the stuffing. And also got some regular cornbread stuff that I could break up. But I'm probably going to have extra bags of stuffing. And I got some regular beverage farm stuffing also. And that's going to, you know, with seasoning and whatnot. I got some bell seasoning for that. And uh, also got a bunch of gravy here. <clears throat> so I got a bunch of turkey gravy. I might throw that in the stuffing to kick it up. A couple of cans of this stuff, cranberry sauce. But we're gonna get the turkey going in the oven. I'll probably take the turkey necks out and boil the turkey necks, maybe with one leg and a thigh in water, and I could use that juice for the stuffing. Now I might not use all this stuff or whatever. I don't use. I just feed to the chickens. I'm not too worried about it. And then I'm going to do carrots and turnips. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do a giant cook here. Then I'm going to like put all the stuff in different containers and I'm going to freeze it. And I'll have Thanksgiving meals for a long time. So I'll try to bring you along as I, as I do stuff and get you some shots and see what it looks like as it goes along. Well, that's what the stuff and I'm going to concentrate on getting the, the turkey cleaned, getting that in the oven, get that cooking. And then we'll start on the stuffing. The stuffing is what's gonna I'm gonna try to spend most of my time on. Right, so I got the two turkeys in there. I got a couple of extra chicken turkey legs. And I got another thigh in over there, so it's pretty full. Just gonna add some water, put some aluminum foil over it and start cooking it. It's gonna go in for 325. So like three hours. I gotta baste it every so often. Add some water to it for so I got some got some broth going on in there. And you, the turkey's gonna give off quite a bit also because it's been uh, you know, I let it defrost, but I don't want to put too much juice in there. Maybe a little bit more. Give it a base every so often. So, um, the stuffing, I got a leg, I got a thigh, I got a couple of chicken necks, turkey necks, sorry, and a heart. 
We're going to cover that with water and boil that. I'm going to cover that with water and boil it, and that's going to be if we have to add any any uh, juice to our stuffing. Right? We have to add any juice to our stuffing. It'll be nice, meaty. Give it a good flavor for the stuffing. I'm just going to cover that and boil it. Yeehaw! Guys, next thing I'm gonna do is cook some of this, render some of this meat down. Hamburg, and then this is the, the sausage. Yeah, I got the legs and the necks going in there. Once I get this all um, cooked well, I'll throw in the charisse because the charisse is already pre cooked. It's a matter of browning it up a little bit. Smell the goodness. Throw the rest of the charisse in there. There's a couple of packets of charisse. That's already pre cooked. And we're gonna put it in the stuffing and we're gonna cook the stuffing also in the oven. So. If you don't mind the uh, the little fan on low like that, hopefully that don't bother you. It might. I don't know. Hopefully it don't. It's cooking, cooking video, right? I got it on low, so. Throwing the green peppers. Onions. Celery. Mushrooms. Cranberries. I'm going to render this all down. Garlic. And uh, crushed red peppers. Throw that in there too. Gotta have that in my meals. I'm gonna render all this down a bit, so give it some time. I got two pans here. I spread the meat out evenly. It's not, you know, it's just, I'm going to spread the meat out evenly and then when I'm done with that, I'll spread that out evenly in both pans. Next level. Smell the goodness. Oh, 
Alright, I think the vegetables are done there. Rendered down enough. We'll put them in the two containers and spread them out and continue. Alright, so I got the I got the the meat out of the thing. You can see how the how the neck and everything. I just gotta let this cool and I'll pull all these bones out of here. And then I can um throw all that in on top of this. I put all the the vegetables up on top of the meat. I'll use that. And then the juice that I cook that in, I'll throw that in there also. Miss Molly, you love Daddy's cooking. I know you do. You love Daddy's cooking. Yeah, I know you love my cooking. Yeah. That's why you got a nice coat. You love Daddy's cooking. Miss Molly. Miss Molly, you want to go out and take a leak? You want to go out and do good girl? Hmm? Miss Molly? Yeah, I can see you licking your lips. You love my cooking. I know you do, Miss Molly. I got the all the bones and the neck and whatnot, and I pull all the meat and cut it all up in little pieces. This is the juice that I boiled all that chicken in, so I had the good. I could add some of that. Um, I got a couple of cans of this to thicken it up. Roasted turkey gravy. to the stuffing. Too much stuff in here, Mama. But well, it did too much, my smaller. That's three bags. We're gonna just mix it all up and give it some juice. And be ready to cook it. Make it nice and moist. That's some good stuff right there. I'm 
first thing, I'll put a couple of these in there. Fresh, fresh cornbread, and we'll mix all that in there and we'll be done with it. And we'll be ready to cook it. Best turkey stuffing ever. We'll cover these with, with, uh, with some foil and we'll bake it for a while and we're good to go. Take the cookers of potatoes and the turnips. I got a couple of containers here we could throw them in. Hope they all fit in there, Mama. Oh, I guess they fit. Might have to add a little bit of oil to the top so it don't bubble over. Tip. I don't know if the other one's going to fit. We're going to find out. I don't know if this container is going to work or not. Might have to get another container for it, maybe. Yo, how you doing? Seeing it's done, but I'm just gonna pull the cover off and crisp it up, I guess. Yeehaw. That's a honky, that's a honky bird. White privileged. That's a white privileged turkey. Holy shit, mama. Damn going woke on us. Turkey's going woke on us, mama. Carrots and turnips. Once I get the carrots all done, I'll mix everything together and add some milk to it. It's like a potato. Carrots and turnips for Thanksgiving. That's kind of like a mainstay, you know. I'm gonna send any pictures of whatever the hell's going on there. No heat. Always no heat. Everybody's got no flipping heat.
There's always a no heat call coming in. Beta masher. Phone ringing off the hook. What's going on here? Alright, I got both the carrots and the turnips here. I'm gonna mix them all up and make make one. We got a live one here, Mama. We got a live one here. Miss Molly, you cutie pie. Miss Molly. Well, 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 Miss Molly. Oh, there, cutie pie. You want to go out? Trying to get her to tan here. This might be a white privilege turkey. Give it another, give it another little douche and we'll um, cover it up, let it set for a while. We'll let it cool. I gotta pull it all apart after. Gotta let it cool down for a while. So I gotta get all the... I gotta get all the meat off the bones. Yeah, nice meal there. Yeah. I'm gonna cover it up. Stuffing still cooking a little bit. Stuffing cook a little bit longer. really good. And stuffing's done. Cranberries and put all the meat in it and I want to overcook it, you know? Looks good. So I got the the broth I took out of it, I got all the turkey all pulled apart in pieces here. And I got the stuffing, and I got the um, carrots, carrots and squash. I'm going to put it all in containers for freezing. Alright, then I got the juice, I just put some juice in there. Give it a little bit of juice. 
I'm gonna freeze it. Six, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. There's thirty meals there. Fifteen and fifteen is thirty meals. You want a plate, Miss Molly? You love Daddy's cooking. I know you love Daddy's cooking. <laughs>